Process Street is the simplest way to manage processes and workflows in your team. There are three key ways we can help you manage the day-to-day -day processes in your business. The first is managing your company procedure documents. Process Street lets you create and manage all of these, including policy or procedure documents, operations manuals, and reference guides. Then, there are trigger-based workflows. These are things that happen at random times, like new client setups, employee onboarding, or promoting a new piece of content. Next, there are your recurring processes and tasks, things that happen at predictable times over and over again. These include daily or weekly tasks, monthly newsletters, and performance reviews. In this demo, we're going to cover procedure documents first. Process Street lets you write documents in seconds from anywhere, with simple drag and drop and keyboard shortcuts. We autosave as you write, plus version the documents automatically. You can use rich content such as files, images, and video to add depth to your documents. Control permissions on documents and folders to manage who can edit and view different processes. Use groups to help make managing these permissions easy. Export documents to Word or PDF to keep your own backup or send them to others in your organization. You can even share your documents publicly with the world or embed them into your website for your customers to see. Documenting your processes is great and it's something you should definitely be doing. But where Process Street really excels is in actually helping you execute these processes, collaborate with your team, and make sure things get done right every time. That's where Process Street is really different. With Process Street, you can turn your documents into workflows. The first kind of workflow I want to talk about is trigger-based workflows. Examples of trigger-based workflows include client onboarding or a new client setup, employee onboarding, employee leave applications, content approval requests, or really any process that happens over and over, but at some kind of random interval. For these kinds of processes, you can actually run your documents as checklists, or what we call micro workflows. In this example of new client onboarding, we would run the process for every new client that we sign up for our service. The same idea for employee onboarding, we would run the process for every new hire. Once you have an active process running, you can invite your team to collaborate and help you complete the process. Track activity from the dashboard or with our detailed activity log and order trail so you know exactly who did what when. Running a trigger based process from inside Process Street is simple and easy. Just hit the run checklist button. But where trigger based processes get really powerful is when we start to connect them to other apps. For example, you could launch a trigger based process off a web form from your CRM such as Salesforce, Pipedrive, and Microsoft Dynamics, from a purchase on PayPal or Stripe or by forwarding an email to a specific address, or even more simply, just tagging an email inside Gmail. Guests are another powerful way to use trigger-based processes. Guests are free and you can have as many of them as you want. A guest is essentially a very limited user that can only see the specific thing that they've been given access to. This is a great way to work with customers or clients for things like requirement gathering, or to work with your suppliers, for example, working with your lawyers to do contract approval flows. The last key area Process Street can help you with is with your scheduled processes. This includes any kind of daily or weekly task, monthly reporting such as sales or cash flow reports, or machine and building maintenance. You know, things that need to get done over and over again at regular intervals. To manage scheduled processes with Process Street, simply go to one of your process templates that you created and set a schedule to run the process. You can set the schedule to run for daily, weekly, monthly, or yearly recurring. You can assign different team members and set due dates on the template. Whenever the template is due, it will automatically be run, it will be assigned to the team members, they will get notifications, and you can come in and make sure that that recurring process was done. These are just some of the many things you can do with Process Street. Check out the user guide for a breakdown on how to use all the specific features. And thanks again so much for taking the time to check out Process Street. I look forward to seeing you on the inside.